Hey y'all, we are officially back to New Beginning. For y'all, it's only been a couple weeks since the last time we saw her, but for us, it's been about 10 to 11 months. So we're very excited to do what we need to do to get her back in the water. Yes, there's a lot of things we want to do to her, but we're only doing what we need to do so we can splash again. It's hot down here. As you can see, I'm already sweating. So let's do it. All right, so what I'm having to do is drop the rudder um, right now we've got it strapped up with some uh, two inch ratchet straps uh, so that way when I do take it apart it doesn't fall on the ground so it takes a little bit of the tension off as I'm starting to take loose of all the bolts um, you will see some corrosion and stuff like that we're going to tackle that once we drop the rudder once we're able to get the cables loose uh, I'm going to take a permanent marker and mark the bolts that tension the cable and that way I make sure I get it back properly um, I've never done this before so I don't know if I'm missing a step or not doing a step correctly but we'll learn together Let's see. as you can tell you can kind of see some of the corrosion there there is a nut in the center of the post that's also connected to I don't know what that piece is called but I'm sure you guys will tell me that all the cables go to for the steering um, what I'm gonna try and do is take that bolt out to see if the rudder will drop without taking all the tensioning off the cables and then that way I can easily manage that at a later time um, but that's what we're doing right now so let's see if I can throw you in here and allow you to watch oh of course the nut isn't three-quarter let me see that three-quarter socket over there I think something's wrong with this one no the socket baby not the wrench oh. It's not three quarter. Let me see that uh, bigger socket in there. Yeah. Oh no, that's too small. So I'm going. How is that not three quarter? I don't know. You pulled that one out, and it says it. It doesn't say that one. Well, the nut on the other side is three quarter. Struggle. Fills, use my screws. Hi, sweet pea. Oh, you're hot. Yeah. Did you run and get ice or did you run back? Did you put all the drinks and stuff in there? Uh, yeah. That were in that one bag? Was it hot? Don't worry, you'll look like this in a minute. Alright, I think it's that tight enough. Look at my face. I know, it's so ugly. Shut up. <laughs> Alright, it's done. You want to use your man muscles? You come help me? Alright. What you need was in that case, wasn't it? That was sitting on. lead in my rear to turn this little bitty socket or this little bitty ratchet. You stop around real good for me too. I was being sarcastic.
buy a boat. It'll be fun. It shouldn't cost that much money. Ah, uh, get one turkey. Oh, yeah. Turkey. Nothing's ever turkey. Unless you buy brand new. Oh, yeah. And it's still not even turkey. <laughs> like an altar boy in the priest's office. <laughs> She is rudder post stop. Needs to be sent it down and repainted. Good okay.
so when uh, Andrew, uh, the soda blaster, comes by tomorrow to start on the boat, or on the bottom, um, I'm going to see if he will uh, blast this to clean this up. All of, all of this is brass. Just kind of clean up this corrosion and looks like where water's gotten in. So, um, we're going to, I'm going to see if he wouldn't mind just hitting this and kind of cleaning it up for me and then we'll put some, uh, we'll find some clear epoxy or something to put back around it to keep it from getting corroded again. Or it still looks pretty. Yeah, it's gunky right now. <laughs> so, as it stands right now, I believe the rudder's ready to be dropped. Uh, what I'm going to do is, uh, I've got everything out of the way. We've got uh, a couple, looks like some kind of plastic gaskets or rubber gaskets or something like that that are, are loose. Um, I don't feel like they should be like that, but maybe they're just there for the, um, whatever that brass pieces that the cables attach to um, maybe that keeps it off of this post so anyways uh, they're pretty dried out uh, I'll, I'll take these to a place today or tomorrow and see if I can get new ones or I'll find out who's got them but in the meantime which the people that were taking the runner to might also have it but in the meantime what I'm going to do is I'm going to take that uh, monster of a boy and see how really strong he is. We're going to go ahead and see if the rudder starts sliding down. And that way we are ready to drop it as soon as they come pick us up. When they pick it up, we can get it out. Alright? You ready? Make sure you got you a good, good handle on it. Okay, you ready? Okay. Yep. Alright, let her down. Let her down some more. I got you. I'm here to help. Yeah. Come on. Come on. Atta boy. Alright. Now that we dropped the rudder, it's time to take New Beginning from the storage yard to the work yard so we can begin to get her all cleaned up and ready to splash again. Stay tuned for our next episode when we have the guys from Easy Blasters sandblast the bottom of New Beginning. Be sure to follow along with our adventures by subscribing to our channel. If you'd like to know when we release new videos, click that bell. If you like this episode, be sure to give us a thumbs up and comment down below to say hello. Thanks for watching, y'all.